Hi. Um, after getting a few comments from teachers about link access and students not being able to access files that they've shared with them, I wanted to give a quick video on maybe um, a way that would prevent this from happening. So once you make your document and you work really hard on it and you want all the students to access it and you're ready to share it, you usually go to Google Classroom and make a copy for each student. However, sometimes students may get blocked out because they are using another device. Maybe they're not using the Teaneck Public Schools Chromebook, maybe they're on their parents' um, tablet or their parents' laptop. And so the original account that's signed in is not their own account. Even though they're able to open up Google Classroom on their account, they're still in like their parents' account. So for instance, I'm just gonna show you here, I'm in my J. Blunt Google account, but here um, I could be in my personal account here. Miss McKee has used my um, laptop, so I could be in her account. So if they're not in their account, it um, sometimes messes up and they're not able to actually access. So one way to prevent this from happening is when you click on share, right? It brings you to this page, which is usually where you would type in the other teacher's emails um, who you wanna share with. But for this purpose, we're just gonna edit or modify the link sharing. So you want to click on this drop down here, go to the button that says more. And you wanna make sure that it's not on this one, which is where it usually is. You want to click on this one, anyone with the link. Anyone who has the link can access no sign in required. This will make sure that if you give out the link, they can just click it and come right to the page. And then depending on what you want them to do, if you just want them to see it, can view, but most of the time we want them to edit. So you wanna select can edit, and then you want to select save here. Now you wanna copy the link. Link is copied to clipboard, done. You can go to your Google Classroom. Um, once you go to Google Classroom, you would go and create your assignments as per use, usual. and however you want to create the assignment and then when you go to add you want to click link and paste the link inside and you also want to make sure you drop down this menu here and click make a copy for each student otherwise everybody's going to be on the same copy um, so make sure you click make a copy for each student Sometimes I've noticed that you can go back in and edit and make this change, and then sometimes it doesn't allow you to make this change. So you might have to do it on the first time that you actually assign it. Once you do that, you can fix all this to whatever you want. Um, I'm not sure if you've seen this feature where you can actually select the students. This is my um, teacher share, so there's really no students but my daughter on here so that I can see a student view, but you can select who you want. Um, to actually get the assignment and then once you select um, you can assign it. I hope this helped and I hope um, this video was smoother than the last. Bye.